Okay, and a venture capitalist is, um, is, a, is a firm. It's usually it's a group of individuals who raise money from um, another group of individuals who are limited partners. And this money becomes a, a dedicated fund that then can be invested in uh, companies, either depending on the stage, maybe startup or later. Uh, and the fund size is usually some very small funds. There would be about $5 million. But the, the fund size tend to be a small fund is, uh, is $200 million or less. Uh, a medium-sized fund is between $500 and $200 million. And you can have large venture funds from $500 to million to $2.5 billion. And so it's a dedicated pool of capital that allows uh, a person in the venture fund to invest in a company in one stage and continue to invest over several periods of time. Uh, and those are as the company hits milestones and reduces risk. And so that's what a venture capitalist would do. And an angel investor tends to be a, an individual. Well, and the individual is investing out of his or her own savings. And, it's, and they're usually by themselves and making independent decisions where venture capitalists would work with other venture capitalists and would syndicate deals. Also, a uh, angel would tend to come in very early in the, in the company's formation. And then the venture capitalist would come in as an institutional investor. It could be a little bit after the angel and then stay with the, the company throughout the rest of its life. The institutional investor is involved in governance, and which is uh, making sure that there's uh, some things called fiduciary responsibility, making sure the company stays on the right path. 